Hello, fellow marketers. I'm Brian Bowie, and welcome to another episode of Directive R&D. In today's episode, I'm going to be talking about competitor keyword research and a cool technique we like to use using SpyFu to spy on your competitor's keyword research strategy. Um, might be a basic one if you haven't, if you've already done this, but for those that haven't, super helpful if you want to understand your competitor's uh, keyword strategy and leverage it for your own PPC or SEO campaigns. So I'm going to get started here. As you can see on my screen, uh, we have SpyFu opened up. They have a free version of this if you want to test it out. You don't get the full data, but you can still uh, see a, enough to gather some insights and see if you want to continue using the tool. But I highly recommend the tool. Very um, useful tool in a lot of different uh, scenarios. So for today's uh, example, I'm going to be uh, putting myself in the project management software space and say I'm Asana. I want to uh, see what other competitors like Monday.com, Airtable, Smartsheet, it's all I can think of, uh, project management suites that uh, could be my competitors. And I want to see what other keywords um, they're, what keywords everyone's bidding on, which keywords they are uh, my competitors bidding on that I'm not. So let's take a look and see what Monday.com is. Uh, the one of my favorite uh, features in this tool is the combat feature where we can put ourselves against multiple domains. Um, as you can see, they already uh, know that Asana is a, uh, a domain that has a high overlap rate with Monday.com, same as Smartsheet. So they automatically input these as examples. Down here, they give you some uh, quick insights around the overall market with how many keywords, core keywords, which uh, show more overlap potential ad ways, consider buying. So some advice if you were or weren't monday.com. Uh, one of my favorite things to look at um, if you were trying to dissect overlap between uh, specific domains or all three domains is these overlap features in this Venn, Venn diagram. I don't think this is a Venn diagram, but this bubble uh, diagram. So say I'm Asana and I want to know what keywords Smartsheet and monday.com are bidding on, but I'm not. Could be a lot of opportunity uh, to scale my campaign strategy. Um, and then I could also see which ones we're all bidding on, um, as well as you know crossing over between the different overlaps. So uh, let's take a quick look. If I click into uh, what Monday and Smartsheet are doing that we're not, um, and down here, it takes you down to the keyword share between these two domains. Um, they have these really cool grouping and filter functions that allow you to, uh, you know, sort by, not sort by, but uh, sort, uh, filter by search volume if you only want to include keywords that have over a certain amount of volume or even CPC ranges. You can, if you have full access to the tool, you can also select keywords to add to like uh, a list that you can export or import to uh, go directly into Google Ads or Bing Ads. So um, really cool tool. Love to use it uh, early on when we're doing in-depth keyword research and understanding the market as well as uh, every now and then checking in to see, you know, if your competitors are, are expanding their keyword reach. Um, and yeah, you can add additional domains here if you want to see what, uh, let's see, Airtable is doing. Um, you can also add more in and they'll add additional uh, domains here and you can change who you want versus and have this drag and drop feature. Highly recommend it, super easy to, uh, tool to use. Um, so yeah, that's just one feature of this tool, but uh, one we use often for competitor keyword research. So um, if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. Um, and yeah, uh, I'll see you in the next lab. Thanks for watching.